Hey guys, Laura here. In today's video, we will learn how to add logo for your video. To do that, we will need to create a logo in the PNG format and with transparent background. And because we're using Canva, it won't be a problem. Like always, let's go to canva.com. In the search bar, type in logo. For this video, we won't create a logo from scratch. I will choose one of the templates and we'll adjust it for this video. Also, I would like to mention that the color of your logo is very important. Because if your logo is white and your video background also is white, it won't be visible. So for that, if you're using a light background, make sure that your logo is in darker color. When our logo is ready, let's go to share. Next, go to download. And before we download our logo, make sure that you tick the box next to the transparent background and then download it. For this video, I made two logos. One is with a light background and the other one with a dark background. Now we have two logos, both in PNG format and transparent. First of all, let's save these logos to the folder for later use. Once again, let's go to share. Under more, you will find save to folder icon. If you have already a folder where you want to save your logo, save it there. If you don't have a folder, just create a new one. Name your folder and press add to new folder. There are two options how we can add logo for our video. While we are still in Canva, I will show you the first option using this platform. Let's go back to home page, go to video. Just to show you how it's done in Canva, I will insert part of this video here and we'll apply our logo. Drag and drop your video into the Canva. If you need, you can adjust your video, uh, how short, how long you need it. So do that. Next step, we need to add new page and this will be for our logo. You can find your logo under projects and also under logos. For this video, let's go to logos section and over here we will need to upload our logo from the file we saved it. I will insert both of the logos and we'll see which one I will use later on. And as a new page. And the trick here is you need to click on logo, right click on it, choose detach image from background. And now we can drag this logo into our video. Let's adjust the size of the logo and I will place it in the left corner. And this is the way how you apply your logo for the whole video. If you want your logo to appear in specific parts of your video, then you need to split your video in more pages. We can go a few steps back to show you how it's done. Just press Ctrl Z for as many times as you need it. And let's say we want our logo to appear just for the first part of the video. I will choose a couple of seconds. To split our video, we need to click on it. In our page, right click on the place where you want to split the video, choose split page, or you can use shortcut pressing S on the keyboard. Now our video is split in two parts and we will apply our logo for the first page. Adjust your logo like we did previously. If you're happy with the result, play your video. You can simply download it or share with others. And if you decide that you want your logo also for the end of your video, you can do the same what we just did with the first page. And this is the way how we do this in Canva. And the second way is uh, simply using your video editor. In my case, I'm using Wondershare Filmora and I will show you how we can do this in there. Drag and drop your logo where you need it. I will add it at the beginning of my video. Now you can adjust your logo, place it where you need it. Here we can see that my logo is just for a few seconds at the very beginning. But if you want, you can apply your logo for the whole video. And like always, play around with it. And this is the way how we can add logo for our videos. Oh, before I go, I want to say big thanks to those people who commented my videos and who sent me direct messages. This is so inspiring. Thank you so much. And I'm glad that I can help you with my content. Once again, thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.